when a record matches these conditions. If these two conditions are met, then we're gonna go about and perform a long list, as you see, of action steps. Let's see how we can build this using the new looping feature inside of automation. Before I have my list, I first have to find the records. So let's first go in here and find records. So this is exactly what we're looking for, all of the records inside of our template. I'm gonna come in here and select that repeating group. I have an input list option in the upper right corner. So let's make the selection here and say use as list. I'm gonna go ahead and for this particular purpose, create a record inside of our production process table. And now we just have to choose the fields that we want to bring in here. Look at this automation here compared to the previous automation for the publication process, which included 24 different steps for building out that automation. 